Valentina. Hi. Hi. Is there any news on Dante? No, not yet. Not that I know of. Okay. Well, I mean, I guess that's kind of good, right? He's still fighting and everything. Yeah, you bet he is. Yeah. I don't know why they're wasting their time at this hearing. I know. I mean, they should be going after whoever actually shot Dante. Uh, why? Well, I think they already found him. I tried to get them to see him last night, but they wouldn't allow any visitors. Have you heard from Diane? Do you know if he's doing okay? I'm sure, I'm sure he's okay. He's recovering from a gunshot wound, Michael. You know, Jason, he's not going to speak up when he needs something. Mom, mom, breathe. I'm breathing. It's going to be okay. Diane is going to get Jason out on bail. Well, that's certainly the plan. Thank you so much for being here. Oh, Carly. I'm not doing this out of the goodness of my heart. You're just, you're just another client. It's just a job. That's your story? No, I'm sticking to it. Michael? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is he signing? No. Not yet. Angelo took a deep breath, let it out, and cast his line into his dream. Just as the war hit the water, it hit him. He caught the wrong man. Dante, I'm going to need you to wake up soon because I'm losing my voice. Okay, then. Next chapter. Carly, did you want to speak with me? Yeah. Do you mind if I step on some lunch? What can I do for you? I was just notified that the hospital wants to move Dante to Turning Woods, and you are the state chief of staff. I need you to stop that from happening. Now we're talking with Dante. No change. You're pushing yourself too hard. Is there anything I can do for you before you head back out? Kicking me out of my own house? I just thought you'd be going to the courthouse. Jason's arraignment. 